chest day, push day. So a little press for time, so we'll see how much we can get done. But we're gonna spend a good amount of time on the flat. A little sore. I'm not, I don't know how, how heavy we can go, but we shall see. Uh, did a pretty extensive warm up, uh, some f mobility work, and uh, yeah, we're gonna start getting into it. see what we could get if I can get at least eight to ten I'll be pretty happy but we'll see I want an empty stomach still sore not complaining but we'll see we'll see what happens got to get these numbers up all right what are you guys doing on the bench what's your what are you currently lifting what's your the goal I want to start getting to 405 where I can do it for, for a couple of reps. I'll, I'll be pretty happy with that. So we're, we're getting there. All right, let's get it. Go up a little bit, let's see what's going on. It's pretty, felt pretty strong, surprisingly. So, I won't get too cocky. We'll see how I do on this, and we'll probably just edit on this one. And I'll start, but it is letting me know I could start, my working weight has gone up. So, we're gonna start making some adjustments. Maybe try a PR a couple weeks and see what's going on. So, it's kinda how I work out my programs to constantly keep growing. So let's see what happens. All right, this is probably gonna be the last set. I'm, I'm hoping it's the last set. I don't wanna put the quarters on. I do not want to put the quarters on. <laughs> All right, let's get this. <sighs> This is still one of my favorite incline exercises. Any gym that I go to, I always make sure, I don't know, I gotta do like incline hammer strength. It's been a favorite. I know a lot of people don't like these machines in particular, which I don't know why, because I mean, it's a good, it's a good, it's a good piece of equipment. But let's see what happens, let's get it in. I don't know what it is, but I still like training heavy. I can't, I can't get away from training heavy, guys. I don't know what it is. I think it's just, or I, can, I know what it is, but it's just that weird personality trait of mine that I just feel the need. I gotta conquer and just, I can't stay settled. You know, if I could, I don't know. If it's 315, I gotta work towards 350 or 365 and four. It's just this weird thing. And, and it's difficult, it's hard to go heavy. So, I don't know. But saying that, let's get some more reps in. I 
have no self-control, guys. That's why we're getting injured. That's why we're getting just all, that's why I'm so exhausted after jujitsu. I just do not know when to quit. I got to blow the, the gas tank out. Gift and a curse. <laughs> I'm an old man, guys. All right, let's go. Oh. Ah. Respectfully and unequivocally, do not give a fuck right now. We're gonna keep pushing. All right, let's do it. Oh! I know people are on the fence with this exercise. You know, some people hate it, it doesn't work. I just like the way it feels, to be honest with you. I just kind of like to finish it off with this or maybe start with this, but I don't know, I just like it. So I still stick with it. I think it feels like I'm getting a great pump. I'm all about the pump, guys. <laughs> and to perform. today's training I'm about to dig into this food i'm starving we got some beef shank with i think like two and a half cups of rice so like i guess i'm definitely been working on trying to put some more size on and just really just trying to heal my body so when i think about it i want to share with you guys i've been dieting you know and being on a caloric restrictive diet or or eating plan for Years, really and truly when I think about it. So, you know, I've had moments where it's like, yes, I'll come off the diet maybe for a week or two and slightly up the calories. But for the most part, no, I've been pretty much eating a restrictive diet, eating at a pretty big deficit for years. And I actually made some mistakes in that in the, the early stages where I was dieting too, too low. And it definitely caused a bit of a slowdown with my metabolism, my enzymes and things like that. So it was interesting getting back to just eating. I mean, for me, I think it's a lot, but in retrospect, I feel it's just eating normal for the amount of output that I do have. But I'm actually dropping weight, but I still feel stronger. I'm getting stronger. I'm looking leaner. So it's interesting. So just recalibrating everything. But yeah, it's time to dig in. More videos are on the way. Appreciate you guys. Let's get it.